y'all it's your girl Michaela Janae back with another video as you can see my nails are not done my hair is not done of course you can't see that but just know your girl's looking pretty raggedy right now because I'm transitioning into another new style so I didn't even want to come on camera to show you guys the ratchetness so I have another haul I'm starting a new hobby and I want to show you guys what I got so this would be a nail haul and an Amazon haul I ordered a bunch of stuff off Amazon and all of it's finally in so I finally get to show you and then I can start playing with my stuff let's just hop right into it first I'm gonna show you guys the things that don't have to do with my new hobby so from Amazon I ordered these batteries for my camera eventually i do plan on getting a new camera but for right now i just want to get new batteries so in here came a two pack of batteries because whenever i'm filming hair videos or i'm filming something really long i always need to charge my battery in the middle of the video or it goes dead or my car fills up so just to avoid that i have three batteries now instead of just one so i don't have to postpone recording especially when i'm sewing and hair those are my two longest videos sewing and hair videos so i really needed these batteries and it also came with this little cleaning cloth which is really nice because i can use this to clean off the lens of my camera and to clean off the batteries so this was on sale i think for like 12 bucks i believe but those are definitely great and they fit in the charger that i got with my camera so i know they work for the camera and they look exactly the same so i really needed that it was about time another piece of electronicness i got was this ub size ub size yeah ub size iphone tripod and i haven't played with any of this yet it comes in this little UB size bag and it also comes with this remote so I can take my own pictures and just like click 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 it up and I think the remote is supposed to be Bluetooth so whenever I have my phone around it it'll just connect you can see like from right here you can hold it like a selfie stick or I could have it on the ground so it'll just be easier for me to record videos on my camera and on my phone so I'll definitely be putting this together and seeing how well it works. It says it's 47.1 inches tall and we're going to see how it works so I can film some better try on hauls for you guys all by myself. I think that's all that I got that is not nail related. If you did not guess, nails are going to be my new hobby. You guys know I already enjoy doing my own nails, but your girl wants to get into doing other people's nails playing with artificial stuff like that i want to make my own press on so i'm gonna bring you guys along on that journey of course before i get into the amazon things i brought let me first show you something i'm so excited about can you see the tacos i got some hollow taco nail polish i was never someone who was a long time subscriber of simply nail logical or anything but i've always loved nail polish i love holographic nail polish and i love rainbow so once i had the money i definitely wanted to order some hollow taco i will be doing a full review and a demo of this nail polish to let you know if it's worth the money the shipping was great the customer service was great and i only ordered three nail polishes and i paid about like 49 bucks and that's plus shipping handling everything they are $13 a piece and I got this super cute blue one the name of this is midnight spark and of course I will be doing a video on each one but I'm gonna just give you a little sneak peek like look at how beautiful this nail polish is I cannot wait to use this one this one is actually for my mother because blue is her favorite color and it was just recently her birthday so i got this one rainbow snow and this is the opaque hollow and this is how this one looks totally beautiful like i am so in love with this color and i also got a hollow taco <laughs> a literal top coat this time and the name of this one is flaky hollow taco i didn't want to get linear or scattered i want like big hollow pieces and i'm just so excited to use these 
they're actually a little bit smaller than I imagined but they're not like tiny or anything they are regular nail polish sized so I like it and it feels really good it feels expensive the packaging feels really good but once again I will be doing a review on this so just know okay so now for the Amazon nail stuff I ordered these Marquette Beauty and Salon nail art nail tips I think I ordered the ballerina kind or the coffin and I'm just so excited to use these these were about ten dollars these are my more universal nail tips more people could wear these and I'm gonna definitely do some organization videos for you guys because I'm not gonna leave it packaged like this but this is a size five and that is how it's looking so it's like my middle finger and I definitely think this is ballerina I don't even think this is coffin so that works I really won't have to do a lot of shaping or anything oh I like it I haven't seen myself with long nails in a while so I'm definitely liking how these nails are looking they definitely feel very sturdy like they're not bendy at all so Marquette look like it is doing pretty well so these are not the only tips I ordered but these are probably the ones that would be the most used I definitely um see myself using this length a lot they're not too short and they're not too long and i'm still able to cut them down if i need to but i think these are very good and they seem durable so that's good i also got these nail tips right here from in fortin i don't even know how to pronounce that but these are my extendo nail tips they are extra extra long so these are actually press-ons and these are a little bit more flimsy than those so I'm definitely gonna see how these work I'm definitely gonna try them on myself before I put them on anyone else but I'm not planning on working with acrylic so the durability of the nail really matters but I just want to play with some extra long lengths so I'm definitely gonna have to organize these because these just came with no numbers or anything and I think I only got like a hundred of these. I'm super excited about these. So basically these two are the only nail tips I got. But I'm definitely feeling like this is the better brand. This is what everyone uses and they feel better. So I would definitely recommend these for beginner nail people. And these are just something I'm trying because I want to practice, you know, long XXL nails. And here I have this file first of all this is a 100 course file that I'm going to use to like you know buff out the nails file it really good this is gonna be like for in a place of a nail drill kind of for me I just didn't feel like ordering one right now I didn't feel like investing so I just got this file that I got from Sally's and I can continue to get from Sally's if it works well for me so this was about two dollars and I also got these diamonds from Amazon this little setup was about ten dollars and I actually saw this setup in a time the infamous video she was doing nails she's not someone I like watch a lot but she did a nail video and she used this setup and it was only ten dollars and I'm like I need that it also came with this wax pencil that I really don't know how to use yet but I'm gonna figure it out and I got all these like little crystals in different sizes and I love the packaging but you guys know I'm gonna have to take it out of here and figure something out and I also got these super duper skinny tweezers like these are going to come in handy to pick those up and pick up other nail art things and I had no idea this even came with that so that is really good because they are so pointy I almost stabbed myself and I have the bigger gems right here so this was a really good kit and all of them are AB and AB is my favorite type of diamond I don't worry about like the clear ones I love AB so I have this little set up this is like my beginner diamonds I don't have any other diamonds for my nails because I never put diamonds on my natural nails something else I ordered for the diamonds is this Gorilla Glue this is the Gorilla Gel and once I was doing my research I realized that a lot of girls were using the Gorilla Gel to apply their diamonds to their fake nails their acrylics all that a lot of people use this um 
gel adhesive resin called the Zule nail adhesive trust me I know about it I've done my research but if I could find something more accessible and order it from Amazon first that's what I'm gonna do so I'm just gonna try out this I'm pretty sure the diamonds are gonna stick pretty well with Gorilla Glue so we're just gonna see how that works out for me and this was about I want to say like two dollars maybe so from sally's i also got a tip cutter which you can definitely find this on amazon for cheaper but i recently went to sally's and i just picked it up this was about i think five dollars and it just helps you to cut the nails a straight edge nail clipper i don't know if i need one of those yet because as you can see like i think i got the ballerina nails instead of the coffin so there's not much i'm gonna have to really do to it so if anything if people want shorter nails i just have this tip cutter i also got a stand for my press on nails with these little pawn looking pieces and you can do your press on nails and you can use this also for pictures but it helps you to have a surface to do them on so you can take it off and like work on each nail one by one i do plan on doing some really cool fun things with my nails to make them unique so it's going to be really important for me to get up close and personal so i can add a lot of detail into every set i do so these were about maybe ten dollars or below ten dollars but this is really perfect as you can see the colors are nice it's really nice and magnetic the only thing i would want is like one of those little magnetic trays to then hold these on because you don't want them to like fall over or anything like that but i might rig something up you guys know i'm a diyer so this is really important so i made sure that i got that i also got on amazon the loctite putty a lot of um nail youtubers they put the putty on here and it sticks to the nails so that's what i'm gonna do i see some girls glue it but that's kind of dumb like you're gonna have glue on the nails and all that so i just rather do this little method of the putty and stuff and this was definitely cheaper than in store so I definitely picked that up and last but not least I picked up these fine nail art brushes like when it comes to nail art accessory definitely get it off of Amazon because these brushes in salads were literally $18.99 and it was just unacceptable these were about six dollars and they are super super skinny and I have some nail polishes that I want to show you guys in this video too but they're not from Amazon they are from big lots but i just want to go through and show you them anyway because it's something i recently brought so let me go pick those up right quick from big lots as you can hear from this bag i spent like 30 dollars on nail polish first i got white and this is called fluffy so you can never go wrong with white especially being a beginner la colors is actually a really good brand so don't sleep on them i'm not gonna be the nail tech that has that uses all china glaze or all opi because i see value in every nail brand so i also got some black and this is called anarchy and especially la colors gel series is actually like really good and i also got one sinful colors like uh, sinful colors i remember back in the day um the og nail youtubers i don't even remember the ones na the woman's name anymore and her nails were long and it was just so pretty if you watch nail youtube back in the day you probably know who i'm talking about and she used sinful colors all the time and i haven't purchased one in so long this is jade cat and it is this super cute pearly type of color and that's one thing that's going to set my nails apart for sure is that i'm a nail polish head but to me me and my mother we have so many and we collect beautiful ones different ones we collect colors that are different and not basic i got this nude color as you know from last week's haul or whatever week that was i've been picking up a lot of nudes because nude ombres are something that's really in and i want to perfect my ombre i want to perfect my ombre with the cosmetic sponges and stuff so i want to pick up the perfect nude this one is more opaque than the regular la colors one i got out of san marcos so i picked this one up and this is in the color vanilla latte so i just had to pick this one up another neutral that i got 
is Chateau and this actually has like a, some type of glitter in it but this is so pretty for like my basic girls that just want a nice neutral nude tone so this is really pretty this color is just beautiful it is just brown bronzy color i can already see some things with this some nail art and i just love it ain't nothing wrong with brown nails okay so i also got these two really cute like to me these are also neutrals like they're not super bright they're just perfect and i got this pink shade and this orange shade the pink is tea time and the orange is topless like these are perfect colors like they're just so beautiful and now for my glitter colors i got this beautiful glitter champagne type of color this one is giddy and they are not transparent they're actually like opaque which is great so i could definitely see this with a nude ombre i also have this darker champagne glitter it is called hyped i also got this pink glitter called knockout and i have this like burnt orange type of red glitter called crush the sinful colors was actually a dollar and all of the other la colors were two dollars so I spent about $25 in that store just on nail polish alone. So Big Lots actually had a lot of great nail stuff. So when it comes to nail polish, I am pretty stocked. All of this stuff was actually pretty cheap. I only paid like $150. I am a beginner when it comes to all that type of stuff. I'm only used to doing my own nails and my own nails are not even artificial nails so i wanted to make sure that i had all the things i could possibly need i think that is all i'm so excited and happy about my little hollow taco that's something i've been wanting to purchase for so long i will do a whole review and demo on that of course it would have been on my nails right now so i could really flaunt it but your girl has just been so busy and i've been waiting for all this stuff to come in before i can play with it so now i can do what i need to do if you guys are interested in seeing me do nails let me know i will definitely record that make sure you're like commenting and subscribing so yeah i'm gonna see you guys later that was me blowing your kiss if if you didn't know <laughs>